Here are some of the most iconic WWE pictures ever taken. Whether it's Shawn Michaels winning the gold for the first time, seeing Sting in the ring for the first time, that classic macho man pose, ooh yeah, or even the Austin era beginning. These are all iconic photos and each have their own special place in history. But as for today, I'm going to be showing you the top 10 rare WWE pictures. Number 10, Andre the Giant's huge ass hands. Now I already know what you're thinking. You're already thinking I've seen this picture a hundred times before. But just look at his hands. Look how big they are. They're huge. They're just, they're just gangster. They're the best, biggest hands I've ever seen. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. A real gangster ass nigga plays his cards right. A real gangster ass nigga. Number nine, Hulk Hogan and Randy Orton. In this picture, you can see Hulk Hogan and a very young Randy Orton taking a picture together. It's almost like they're gangsters too. Wait, 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 I am not using that joke two times in a row. You guys are gonna get burnt out. Number eight, is that Sergeant Slaughter? This is a very unique picture of Sergeant Slaughter. Uh, I don't really get what the rat thing is on his chest, but there's a flying fucking rat on his chest. Number seven, we the people. In this picture, you see a very young, fit looking Zeb Coulter, AKA Dirty Dutch Mantel. This picture is probably rare because you're young. So yeah, enjoy it. Number six, CM Punk as a teenager with Stone Cold Steve Austin. I wish I could show you this picture a little bit longer, but CM Punk kept bitching that he doesn't want to be here, so he just eventually left. So yeah, later CM Punk. Number five, Undertaker in basketball. In this picture, you see Undertaker using some of his sweet ass basketball moves. Now I know this video is about rare pictures, but I did manage to find some video of Undertaker making a sweet ass dunk. So why don't you check it out? Number four, skydiving on my day off. This apparently is what Shane and X-Pac do on their day off. The only thing I'm wondering is why in the hell does it look like X-Pac has his ring gear on? Number three, BSK for life. BSK stands for Bone Street Crew, and that is Undertaker's gang that he had back in the day. He actually got a tattoo of it, believe it or not. This picture that you're looking at right here is some of the baddest men back in the locker room back in the day. I wouldn't want to mess with them if I were you. Number two, party time. This picture pretty much speaks for itself. This is a whole bunch of WWE superstars getting shit-faced and having a good time. Who knows, possibly even doing drugs. I mean, just look at Shawn Michaels over there. And number one, we are ending our list on a very somber note. This is the last picture of Chris Benoit. This picture gives me goosebumps just looking at it, thinking that he might have just killed his family shortly after taking this picture. It is very sombering to look at. All right, everyone, if you were able to reach the end of this video, you are awesome. If you feel like helping me, you can always hit that like button. You can always share my videos, Twitter, Facebook, the whole thing, help get my name out there. If you did reach the end of this video, thank you so much. I hope you consider subscribing. Tell me what you want to see. I will do any kind of video idea. I'm not opposed to anything. So until the next video, guys, I will see you later.